Hi guys, Matt from 123 Maya T here. Uh, just a quick one today. Just wanted to show you guys, tell you guys to, um, if you use a Mac, to go ahead and start downloading uh, the latest version of Mac OS. Otherwise, it will actually disappear from your App Store. So at the moment here, it's Mac OS Monterey, but the Mac OS Ventura has been released in. Um, well, it's been released in June, but that's the beta version. But the actual version will probably um, be released a little bit later on in September, which means that in your app store here, it will actually, Mac OS Monterey will actually disappear and you will start to get um, the new version and you won't be able to download this version anymore. So what I suggest is to go through and actually download a copy of this and just keep it offline in case you ever want to downgrade uh, your Mac OS. If you have a look in here, you can see here, here are all the older uh, operating systems, Mac OS operating systems. If we want to try and even, in, even install Big Sur, we tap that one, you can see it just doesn't come up. Okay, so this is what I mean. It will actually be removed from your um, from your app store. Now, the, the rule to this is, if you've downloaded one of these older ones previously, you will have and it, and it was on the same machine, then you will have a copy of it um, uh, in here that will pop up in here. But what will happen is when you change computers, if you don't download that version, you will actually lose the, um, lose the download uh, from your, your um, app store. So to download it, obviously go and do a search for Mac OS in your app store. All right, then it will come up here. You just wanna hit view and get all right, and then it says, "Do you want, are you sure you want to download it, Mac OS? We just want to go download, okay? And then you see here it says uh, it will download uh, 12 gigabytes. So we'll just let that go ahead and download, and then we'll, I'll uh, pause the video, and then once that's finished, um, I'll show you how to then copy that out um, so you can have a copy of it, and you won't lose it in the future if you ever want to downgrade back to your old operating system. Okay, cool, so you can see that it's downloaded now. So if we just minimize that, you can see that Mac OS Monterey has started up. So you can go ahead and install that, but what we actually wanna do is, if you go down into your launch pad, you can see it here, but we're going to go up into Go, and go down to our apps, and then you can see it's actually downloaded into our applications. We just wanna drag it out, And copy it, put it on your desktop. We've already got one here, we're just going to replace it. I already did one earlier. Okay, and then get info. Now you can move this file to like an external hard drive or somewhere that have plenty of storage. You've always got the Mac OS Monterey um, file to install if you want to reinstall that, and then that way. If it disappears in your app store, you've always got a copy of it uh, to come back to. So rather than losing your your download um, of, the, of the OS that you might like, you've got a copy of it uh, always there ready to go. And you can install this via USB. You can put this on a USB and install it via USB on other Macs as well. So it's just really helpful to um, get a copy of it and then you've always got it there if you wanna use it in the future. Right guys, hope that was helpful. If this was helpful, please leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.